good day fairies so I'm going to use this na yeah finally but before that I'm going to prep my skin with azelaic acid so yeah that's already my first thing to do in the morning so I'm going to do see yeah so next is this oh someone for wait. someone something so it's sealed so we're going to remove the seal for the first time oh there we have it can you see the color uh, i hope it's effing skin tone they only have one shade and According to the box, it's 30 SPF and 50 ml. The Africa Bird Home BB Moisturizer evens out the tone and texture of men's skin. It's literally saying here that it's for men, yeah. It's formulated for men, but I really wanna use this because it's all in one. You have the, uh, no, um, this already have a face primer, sun cream, and BB effects, so, yeah. Oh, let me see. It's kind of skin tone for me, yeah. You see this? I'm going to put it in my face, on my nose. And you see the color difference, so. So, yeah, it's, I like it. This, the smell is like sunscreen. The coverage is very light. It's like you're not, you're putting nothing on your face. Like that. I have redness here and pimples and everything. doesn't really cover them well but it will reduce the redness for my under eye mm -hmm. nothing happened I still see my dark circles but who cares I'm here for the benefits of baobab extract and rooibos so so i'm going to update later after the whole day of what will happen to my face i bought this for 625 so it's kind of expensive for only 50 ml like what the heck i have much cheaper brands i have here fashion 21 yes they're bb stick but well, they cover, but it kind of. I have flaky skin due to me using retinol and acne product, so my skin is kind of dry on some parts. And it's flaky when I use Fashion 21 on area like that. doesn't really have coverage like you're putting nothing on your fucking face every face it's just it's just sunscreen yeah oh, it's sunscreen bitches but like i said we are here for the benefits of baobab extract and rooibos extract extract so it's good for anti-inflammatory so i'm going to insert a text in this video regarding on the two extract Hmm, I'm gonna put more on my nose. Oh. I hope this won't break me out because I have acne prone skin. So I think I'm done. Mm -hmm. So I'll be back later on what will happen on my face. 
on what will be the effect or you know if I notice the redness or my pimples you know like that you see You see the redness? I have pimple marks here and around lower here. So I like the dewy effect of this. Like, oh my gosh, it's so good. Fairies, I'm back and it's been around uh, maybe 10 minutes. And I noticed that first it doesn't have a tingling sensation or you know, the one that it's like something is poking on your face or itchiness um, well it doesn't cover much of my redness yeah um, I mean my pimples yeah that like that but overall it reduced the redness and inflammation yeah I could say that and the skin tone is kind of you know brighter than my neck compared to my neck as you can see yeah it's kind of different but it's okay it's not that I know I'm not that fair skin so I need you know darker color of BB cream that's why I bought you know fashion 21 because they have a darker shade so but because fashion 21 flakes my skin this doesn't flakes flakes flake my skin yeah the dry the dry part of my face doesn't flake it and what else um yeah i don't feel the tightening no tightening on my face it's like flexible and everything mm -hmm. and well the dewy it's dewy as you can see it's like i have effing natural oil on my face well, I think that's good. I like that thing that it doesn't effing look dry. So, I'll be back later again around 8 p.m. And let's see what will happen on, yeah, on my face. Um, hello, I'm back. So, this is a quick update. So, I just got home. I bought some, uh, myself some two slices of pizza and some effing Pringles. So yeah, quick update. I have big pores and large pores. So yeah, when I'm exposed to heat, to the sun, my pores become more and large. So yeah, it looks bigger. But um, yeah, if you're looking for something to hide your pores, well, this isn't it. And well, sti I still have it on my face. It doesn't oxidize is that what it called but it's still on my face uh, I've already sweat a lot and as you can see my face is effing more oily than before yeah so this is the last update and I can say that it's already 750 and yeah as you can see my face is oily I wouldn't recommend this if you're looking for a product that will effing make your face dry as fuck, you know, matte as fuck, you know, no oil, zero oil face. I don't like that kind of uh, look, so I'm I'm oily, but I like this dewy effect on my face that it gives me. It does a really good job on moisturizing the, the parts that I have, you know, peeling effect, flaky skin and everything, so... I really do like it honestly even though it doesn't give me the total oil control this will be rec I wouldn't recommend this if you're really looking for a dry look well for if you're looking for a you know dewy look like this natural this is a really go-to product and you know if you're looking for an all-in-one product because this is a moisturizer a primer and a SPF sunscreen so yeah it's really you really need to try this but yeah I really do love it so I'm looking forward for the long-term effect of the baobab and rooibos extract so yeah I really do like it 
I'm gonna definitely buy another bottle after I use up my first bottle. Yes, I'm really in love with. Yeah, it only have one shade, but it's fine. It like kind of adapts on your skin tone. Not really, but yeah, I hope they make a uh, more darker shade. But I'm really okay with this now. I'm totally fine with using this, and I'm happy with the product, even though it has only one shade. Because the reason I have Fashion 21 because they have a really darker shade, as in really dark shade. I don't. Wait, let me get my bag and I'm going to show you how dark I'm talking about. So here it is. We have these two shades. Yeah. This one is really dark. This is the warm tree warm tea. And this one is let me see. Okinawa tree, the lighter one. Yeah. So I combined these two. But yeah, it dry it shows the dryness on my skin because I'm using tretinol and retin A or peeling solution. So um, I don't like it. Yeah. It's not fully oil controlled, but it doesn't also moisturize your face. It has tea tree oil for acne, but I don't think it really does a good job on keeping my acne at bay. So yeah, I think I'm going to stop using this. I don't know if I'm going to use it all up or I'm going to effing just throw them. Well, one one stick costs around what 100 195 so almost 200 pesos i couldn't still effing buy the what you call it nature republic product because that's effing 625 and combine these two it's only just 400 so yeah but i'm going to definitely still buy the nature republic product the africa bird bb moisturizer because i really do like how it effing moisturized my um, peeling area of my skin, my face. So yeah, even though they don't have a darker shade. And hopefully in the future they would make something, you know, kind of darker. Because I don't like when my face is effing whiter than the rest of my body. It's like, what the fudge? I'm not a geisha. 